everyone, it's Dee's from Turtle Dove. How's everyone doing today? I just thought I would come on and do a very quick haul from the chemist warehouse. Um, I went to the pharmacy recently and I wasn't going to do one. I thought, no, I'll share it with you. So, first thing I bought, I was actually really annoyed at this. These were $18. Um, surgical face masks. 50 pieces, 18 bucks, and that was normally, I think, $30. But today I went into the browsing and they had similar, different brand, 50 pieces for $10. <laughs> so I was a little bit annoyed I could have saved $10, but never mind. I've got them now. So South Australia, we have to um, wear face masks anywhere in public. So I do have some fabric face masks, but... They need to be washed and sometimes I run out so I bought these. So we have plenty. I bought uh, these butt and foot crystals. I think they were only three dollars. Um, the other week I did buy um, the same but a different um, smell. This one's she butter scent. I'm going to smell it for the first time. Mmm, this is really nice too. I thought the last one was nice. I can't remember what the scent was on the other one. It was the yellow crystals. Oh, it's very nice. Sort of perfumey, but without being too, you know, over overly powering. So this is for bath and foot. So... I am going to give my feet uh, very soon a nice soak. I might even put some nail polish on my toes. I normally do that for summertime because there's no point in the winter because your feet are always covered. So now I have very sensitive skin. At the moment, I'm using Sorvaline cream, and I'm I've got about a third left. I always buy these big um, pump containers. This is 1.25 litres. This was almost $20. Quite expensive, but it does last for a long, long time. So I always like to look ahead and if I'm halfway through something, I'll try and buy the next, another one, uh, the next time for when I run out. So it's sitting there waiting and I don't actually run out and be without for a couple of days or so. So this is, I uh, swear by this, it's just I had, this, when I run out of the last QV moisturiser, I found that I had that big Sorbeline, a bottle of Sorbeline cream in the cabinet. So I thought I would just use that up, even though I don't like it as much as this. So otherwise it's a waste of money. So I'll have that sitting there waiting for when I run out. And I buy this probably every three weeks or so. QV Flare Up Face Wash. I still use that uh, as well. Together with another, another one that I use. But I alternate. I found this Insta Dry Prismatic Shine by Sally Hansen and it's cornflower blue I think in 025 I don't have my glasses on so but it's a really pretty blue so I might put that on tonight or tomorrow and this is the W7 It's Magic Makeup Remover Cloth now I have a few I have a long one which I think is the same as this one and then I have some little, little just little squares of the same sort of fibre I'll show you I thought this was five dollars but it was actually ten so but I wasn't going to argue about five dollars I think they had the price in the wrong spot um, unless I looked wrongly which I sometimes do I really like to make sure you can't get into them. 
and these are really good. Um, the long one that I have already, it's quite old and thin, so that one's almost ready to be thrown out. So I thought I'd get a new one. Oh, it's purple. I thought it would be purple. That's great. Oh, it's a big one too. Oh, the one I've got about half as narrow. It's as wide, but so that's why it was ten dollars and not five. They had some little um, round makeup removers, probably as big as my palm, in rainbow colours in the same sort of fabric. Um, but that was five, and they're just a little bit too small. I might still get one eventually, but just wanted the bigger one for now. And oh, I'm really pleased with that. It's so soft. So I just use that at the end of the day um, with something like that. You don't, they say you don't have to use anything like this, you can just use warm water. But I always like to sort of cleanse my face, give it a bit of a deeper cleanse with some product. And then in the morning I wash my face with uh, the other branded stuff that I use which I can't think at the top of my head at the moment. Um, but this is really soft and you do realise how thin they are if you've been using them for a while. <laughs> so I'm glad I got this one actually. And that is it. That is my haul. And because I spent over $60 I got a free little hand sanitizer, which is nice. So that's it guys. Hope you enjoyed this haul. Thanks for watching, take care and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.